Welcome to the New Calculus channel. I am John Gabriel. This video is entitled Academic Ignorance and Stupidity Part 4. So <coughs> in this video I'm going to talk about Grandi's series. Okay. Now Grandi's series is this series here. And it was discovered by an Italian myth mathematician uh, at about the same time as Cesaro. There's also something called Cesaro summation. Um, it's it's a load of garbage, but I'm not going to focus on that right now. But rather, I'm going to focus on Grandi series <coughs> and how. Uh, mathematicians of today reach the conclusion that that is equal to a half which is of course untrue because this here is not a closed form and we can prove this by by finding a way to represent the series so how, how can we represent the series well we can use partial divisors and I'll show you how partial divisors um, <coughs> with the following fraction. So 1 plus x is equal to 1 minus x or is it plus x? Well let's check it out. It's 1 divided by 1 plus x that goes into the 1 plus x. Yep, so it's minus x, right? It's minus x. The next one will be minus x minus x squared. Okay, so so it alternates between negative and positive. Very good. So <coughs> we can see now that to get a half, all we need to do is set x is equal to 1 here. And so we'll have 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus dot dot dot. And that looks remarkably similar, in fact exactly the same as that. However, this here is not equal to 1 over 1 plus x. That's right. It is approximately equal to 1 over 1 plus x. Okay? It is approximately equal. There is a closed form of this. And to see the closed form is very easy. We could stop after any of these remainder steps and obtain a closed form. There are infinitely many of them. Supposing we stopped after the first one, this one here, the closed form would be what? It would be 1 minus x over 1 plus x, right? And so if we substitute 1 in there, we'd have, which gives us exactly a half, which is correct. Okay, so the closed form gives us a half. This here is nonsense. Uh, it's nonsense because there is no last k term and this here is the last k term in this particular closed form. Okay. And we could also have got another closed form here. We could have said, okay, at that stage, 1 over 1 plus x is equal to 1 minus x <coughs> plus x squared over 1 plus x. And once again, that will give us a half. Okay. So any of the closed forms of this, where we have the kth term, will give us exactly a half. This series on its own is a load of rubbish. And what I wanted to uh, bring to your attention here is that uh, this particular series, the result of this series, is used in... in uh, another result and the other result is this the sum from k equals 1 to infinity of k is equal to minus 1 over 12 of course that's a load of rubbish too and it happens to be the very basis of string theory in physics <laughs> so string theory relies on this fact here which is nonsense uh, can you imagine how rigorous string theory can be then in that particular case? Probably not very rigorous. At any rate, um, this is the Grandi series which is used. And on Wikipedia, they have uh, an integral proof of it. It's not really a proof. It's actually, 
it's actually fake, uh, but it it gives an outline of a proof as follows, and then basically shows that that this here can be expanded using Taylor series so that you have cos x, a whole series of uh, non-terminating terms with cos x and sine x and different signs. But that is not a proof. Okay, so what I, what I want to do, just bring to everybody's attention here, is that Newton was the first person to begin working with these partial divisors. I doubt he called them that. In fact, I'm the first to call them partial divisors. And you'll see a lot more of this in my videos called Exactly What is Division and Polynomial Division. And also, you'll see a lot more in the video called uh, Why One Third is Not Equal to 0 0.333 and Newton and His Fake Infinite Series. So there are quite a few of them out there and I encourage you to watch them. So uh, I also uh, uh, would refer you to another subscriber who has some interesting videos along this line, somebody called Penny Karma, and he has some nice videos on the topic too. Uh, uh, you could probably just go along and take a look at those yourself. Um, I'm not saying I endorse everything he writes, but some of these videos are really uh, interesting and informative. So, at any rate, that's all I have to say for this uh, YouTube episode. Uh, I'm John Gabriel. This is the New Calculus Channel. Join me next time.